welcome to Learn Commerce PU Online Classes. forget to like our video and subscribe our YouTube channel for all the updates. Welcome to our first PU Computer Science online classes. In last class, we know that we studied some important concept from control statement as we know that is from chapter 10, the control statement and we already started some practical programs and we know that some important programs are the interchange of variables with or without using the variables here, uh, without using the third variable or maybe area and circumference or we can say that area of a triangle or maybe the, um, the total amount of the bill or the final, uh, final amount of the bill as well as uh, the year, maybe it is a leap year or not and always uh, we can say that lastly that is about uh, the character is a lower case character and the upper case character. Okay. Now, after that we know that some points are there about the switch statement. Correct? Now, the fourth types of the selection statement is called as the switch statement. Okay. And we know the syntax of the switch statement in today's class or in this class I am not going to tell more uh, explanation about the switch statement as we now as we know that we already explained uh, in case of our uh, last chapter that is our problem solving technique correct now this switch statement just only the syntax I am going to tell how to write the syntax of the switch statement so the switch opening of the parenthesis control expression closing of the parenthesis the next closing of the uh, or here we can say that closing of the parenthesis the next thing opening of the flower bracket case 1 colon statement 1 semicolon break semicolon correct here case 2 colon statement 2 break semicolon here case 3 colon statement 3 semicolon break semicolon and default later next one the colon default block semicolon and the break semicolon lastly we are going to close the flower bracket so this is about our switch statement the syntax of the switch statement as we know already know uh, about our some explanation about the switch statement okay now after the switch statement the next most important concept the concept name is called as the iteration okay here the concept name is called as the iteration as we know that such iteration only call as the loops okay the spelling of the loop l o o p s here now let's first of all the meaning of the iteration so what about the iteration here as we know that it is the ability of a programming language to repeat set of the statement correct now here may be that means it depend on the condition if the condition is true it going to repeat this statement again and again until the condition becomes satisfied or false so this is the meaning or the concept of our iteration that is only called as the loops clear this point artha itellarige iteration or loops yavudakke now helteve that means here it is the ability of the programming language to repeat set of this statement correct now to repeat a single statement or the set of this statement again and again until the condition becomes satisfied or false elli varige now repeat process annu repeat maartta hogteve elli varige namma condition true agirthade alli varige now process annu repeat maartta hogteve yavaga condition false aagutade we need to, to comes out of this structure so this is about our iteration here and here we can say that this condition may be predefined or post defined so what about the predefined what's this spelling i used in case of the predefined P R E. Don't think about free. I am not going to tell F R E E. I am telling predefined here. P R E. Clear this point here. So we can say that in case of our iteration or the loops here, some of the conditions are there. So the condition may be here predefined or post defined. As we know that predefined that is equal to while statement. Post defined that is equal to our 
do while statement correct no kya okay now let's the uh, types of the looping structure kya so as we know that we use three types of the looping structure in our c++ so three types of looping structure in our c++ are the first one is the while statement second one is called as the do while statement and the third point is called as the for statement artaita nan iga yavudralli idene iteration or loop in a types alli ide as we know that in our c++ the iteration types are the first one is the while statement second one is called as the do while statement and third one is called as the for statement okay now let's the first for the first point i want to select the first point is the while statement hagadre while statement ina bage now yen helbodu idralli as we know that first of all i am going to start the explanation of the while statement here the structure is also called as the pre tested looping statement correct no the other name of the while statement so what's the other name of the while statement the other name of the while statement we can say as the pre p r e okay pre tested or testing looping statement here and we know that in our while statement the checking of the condition is done at the beginning itself correct no kya first of all now yen martteve yava execute yava ka statement execute aagutade so in case of the while statement we can or we can execute this statement after checking of the condition correct no so in while statement the checking of the condition is done at the beginning point itself okay kya first of all now condition anu check martteve condition true idre matra this statement going to execute here and later words we can say that here if the condition is true as we know that if the condition is true the statement block or maybe a single statement repeated correct no yeah repeated or executed again and again until the condition becomes satisfied or until the condition becomes false yelli varige repeat aagutade yelli varige namma condition true agirutade alli varige namma statement execute aagutade yavaga namma condition false aagutade that means it going to stop the loops of the statement correct no here that means here we can say that the control goes to the next statement of the loop in case of the while statement so arthaita while statement yen anta helidre so in while statement i said the other name is the pre tested looping statement checking yavaga aagutade here we can say that the checking of the condition is done at the beginning point itself here yeah. and if the condition is true then statement block or statement executing or executed again and again until the condition become satisfied okay so this is the most important note or we can say that point in case of our while statement okay now after completing the meaning of the while statement let's how to write the syntax of the while statement so in case of the single statement that means sure how we are going to write so this syntax is also called as the general form okay syntax and now general form anta kuda now helbodu the general form or the syntax of the while statement we can write as the while then opening of the parenthesis okay the common bracket we need to open here and later next one maybe if you are going to write test condition or just only the condition no any problem okay both are same arthaita new parenthesis open adanantra test condition bardre otherwise if you are going to write just only the condition no any effect in the program okay kya and later next one test condition then closing of the parenthesis bracket okay kya and if the condition is true executing this statement if you want you can write the statement only otherwise you can And write the statement one semicolon. So arthaita that means this syntax applying just when the test condition or the while test condition executing. only one statement is syntax yavaga apply aagutade yavaga now condition test madida nantra just only it going to execute one statement okay in a program then only such syntax going to apply so clear this point here let's see the other syntax of the while condition here so the other syntax we can write or the general form we can write for the while statement as the while opening of the parenthesis test 
condition closing of the parenthesis and later next one we need to open the flower bracket okay kya statement 1 semicolon statement 2 semicolon statement 3 semicolon and closing of the flower bracket arthaita so here we can say that what's the difference to our first syntax and to the second syntax so here we can say that the different is just only in our first condition if it going to test the condition if it is true only one statement going to execute okay here but in our second syntax we can say that first of all it going to check the condition both are same that means checking of the condition is dark here so when it going to test the condition on that time it executing the block of statement as we know the meaning of the block of statement the block of statement we can say that the group of statement and that are separated by semicolon and enclosed within curled braces curled braces and the flower bracket okay here so such one is called as the block of statement or the compound statement so clear the difference between the difference is just only in our first uh, syntax here just one statement going to execute but here many statement going to execute in case if you are going to execute many statement here that means such a statement we need to enclosed within curled braces the curled braces only call as the flower bracket okay kya? so this is the syntax of the while statement syntax now let's the flow chart but because here these two flow chart are there as we know that we already written two syntax correct no so depend on the two syntax here we need to complete the flow chart so first flow chart i am going to take the first flow chart that means uh, by using based on this syntax okay kya? so while test condition statement to one semicolon so in the very again and flow chart one complete martin now this is the now for this syntax we can write the flow chart as the first of all it going to test the condition okay is condition and the question mark still here i don't know whether the condition is true or false here i am just going to test the condition by using this symbol the symbol is the decision symbol as we know that in our flow chart many are the symbols symbols are there correct no the many uh, symbols are there here so we can say that maybe the terminal symbol input output symbol process symbol here decision symbol is it correct here looping statement symbol or maybe the direction or flow of direction here connector symbol so many type of the <coughs> symbols are there here so just to take any condition that means the decision okay here i want to take one decision then sure the symbol going to apply the symbol name is called as the decision symbol so i am just using is condition i don't know whether the condition is true or false if such condition is true here t means the meaning of the t is the true only if such condition is true then statement one going to execute correct now so like our syntax here if such condition is true or maybe we can say that test condition is true statement one going to execute if such condition is yes the meaning of the yes is called as the false okay here if such condition is false as we know that the control that means goes to the next statement of the loop here so this is our first syntax of the while condition now let's the second syntax of the while condition that means here the, this is the second syntax of the while statement here while test condition as we know that the condition must be put inside the parenthesis parenthesis only call as the common bracket okay kya? and later next one whatever the statement as we know that in our block of statement the group of statement going to execute so such one going to uh, use uh, or enclosed within <coughs> curled braces flower bracket now let's how to write the flow chart for such syntax here so no any difference so in case of our first flow chart or to our second flow chart so here we can say that as we know that maybe if you want to take some of the decision then sure the decision symbol going to apply so is condition if the condition is 
true then statement 1 statement 2 statement 3 how many statements are there although statement going to execute one after the another yavaga if the condition is true okay here if the condition is false that the f is called as the false here if the condition is false that means we can say that the control goes to the next statement of the loop correct Nakya? if the condition false means it's going to uh, jump or we can say that the control comes out of this structure here so this is some explanation about our <coughs> while statement the syntax of the while statement the block of syntax of the while statement and the flowchart for first syntax as well as the flowchart for our second syntax here yeah. now let some important note about our while statement so in case of the while statement as we know that first of all the condition is tested correct now yavaga yen aagutade yavaga statement execute aagutade as we know that the statement going to execute after checking of the condition only correct no okay? so we can say that the condition is tested in case of the while statement okay okay and later if the condition is true here okay, then statement or block of statement that means inside the loop is executed correct now if the condition is true maybe we can say that if one statement that is called as test only statement here one statement that means our statement only or we can say that the set of statements set of statement means group of statement statement one statement two statement three here so we can say that if the condition is true then statement or we can say the set of a statement inside the loop is going to execute or execute it here so this is about our second point in case of the note of while statement and later next one after executing this statement again it going to check the condition correct now the condition is tested again clear this point here so after executing first of all test martive condition condition true either statement execute after the other and interest execute other and interest statement again we are going to test the condition so just only I return as the the condition is tested again here and later words if a condition is true sure it going to execute the statement and lastly we can say that so the process is continued or repeated until the condition becomes false Eliyavarike repeat after the Nama statement execution Eliyavarike repeat after the Or Eliyavarike we are going to test the condition So we can say that here That means the process testing of condition Executing the statement Testing of condition Executing the statement So this process is repeated or continued Until the condition becomes false Okay kya? And later lastly we can say that When the condition becomes false The control comes out of the structure That only we can say as the the control or the compiler control goes to the next statement of the loop here so this is or all are the important note about our while statement so clear this point here so this is about some uh, some point in case of the while statement here thank you don't forget to like our video and subscribe our youtube channel for all the updates